Um, hey guys, let's talk about love. <laughs> I was raised on love at first sight. That terrified me. I've got a lazy eye. <laughs> As you get older, it's even more complicated. All these things you're meant to do, rituals. Valentine's Day is so funny, isn't it? Things you're meant to do. Oh, lingerie for the lady. Put it on, put it on, put it on. Yeah, now take it off. <laughs> weird erotic buckaroo but <laughs> at least it works a woman in underwear looks sexy a man in his underwear he looks like he's forgotten his PE kit Just <laughs> I love that there's older people laughing and younger people I don't know why that's funny that's because when we were kids <laughs> we forgot our PE kit we had to run in the woods in our pants with a teacher like that <laughs> how could we never question how deeply creepy that is <laughs> I've forgotten my PE kit, so I'll probably just wear my normal clothes. You won't, you'll get your dick out now. <laughs> Love's a complicated thing, you know? And we're weird people are weird. I read this the other day. Apparently, 50% of British people admit to having abnormal sex. <laughs> what does that mean? What is it? Abnormal? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, now hit my tits with a frisbee. Like, what is. <laughs> Put those scrabble pieces up my ass. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> What have I spelled? <laughs> Just says help. <laughs> Who answers yes to that? That's what I want to know. Just a couple of little old lady and her husband. Hello, are you into abnormal? Oh, yeah, mad as fuck, aren't we, Bernard? Yeah. Strangle wanking, that's my thing. <laughs> I like to choke it before I stroke it. We'd love to stay, but we're after by a fuck swing. As you were. <laughs> I'm not into abnormal sex. I mean, you know, I'll give you a mish and that's your lot. The... <laughs> Like, sex in the bath, like, it's like, ugh, it's just, you get taps in your back. And, and, and from time to time, I will get a little bit gassy. That happens. And in the normal lovemaking arena, you can let out a little, ah, a fart, and nobody knows. It's just, oh, hi, hello, hello, do do. But in a bath, there is no amount of rose petals <laughs> or radox that can cover that ghastly noise of... <laughs> It sounds like the Churchill dog eating yogurt. Just <laughs> are we going to be having sex? Oh no 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 no! There's loads of weird things. Stay can blow job day. That's another thing. That's a, apparently a thing that people do. The world. Did you know about this? I've only just found out. One lady. Woo! I can do it at the same time. I burnt my face the other day. <laughs> It was a thing. Slake and blow job, you get you, you give the man meat and then you bloody bloody blue. <laughs> my brother was telling me and my mum and my nan about it. Like genuinely, <laughs> steak and blow job day! My favourite day of the year! I like my blow jobs, like I like my steak. Well done! <laughs> my mum looked at him and went, yeah, and when you have them, it's rare. <laughs> <laughs> it's an amazing one. Let's have some questions. <laughs> Randolph. Russell, darling, what is your favourite piece of literature? <laughs> well, Randolph, I'm very much a fan of The Catcher in the Rye. I find the protagonist to be quite the hoot. <laughs> Alicia, do you like a finger up the arse? Well, they're... <laughs> very different questions there. <laughs> Randolph going for literature. Alicia, finger up the arse. I don't mind it, Alicia. <laughs> Um, warn me. That's the only thing I would say. <laughs> Send me an email <laughs> or a text. Like it is that thing. I don't know if you've ever had a finger, but I mean, it very much. You mean very? Yeah. You get your instant attention, isn't it? It's just, yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. I will put the bins out. Point well made. <laughs> I'm up, mum. I'm up. I'm going to school. <laughs> yeah. Forget about alarm clocks. If you've got a sleepy teenager, just whoa. Okay. <laughs> I am gonna learn. But the finger going in, I'm not massively keen on. <laughs> Being pulled out... <laughs> not entirely against it. <laughs> if I was in a gay relationship, what I would advise you as my boyfriend to do, knock me out, <laughs> pop your gear in, <laughs> and then... <laughs> <laughs> sort of... 
Wake me up before you go go. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> You'll find a very happy young man. <laughs> um, Daniel, why do women go to the toilet together? I don't know, probably to protect themselves from Alicia. <laughs> <laughs>